What's up guys, it is JBeats here and welcome back to another episode of the Sarbrooken Road to Glory. I like we're going to start things off with a successful transfer offer for our center back, Zellner, who we are looking to sell because in the last episode, we were able to get the final pieces to our hopeful back line for the next 10 plus years. Our youth scouts have been absolutely killing it this season, and hopefully that is something that continues, as it would be very nice to have a, a solid, strong youth academy for this team for the rest of this career mode. Right, I think we signed a couple of players from Germany, so we'll check them out in the Youth Academy after we deal with... Nope, we're also getting rid of you, Thulk. Sorry, but you just don't have a spot in the team anymore. We're not going to... There's, there's an extremely low chance we will get promoted this season, so I'm really prepping for next season. So my left... <laughs> one of my left backs... Potential left backs... As an outside the foot shot. Sure. Actually, what's my current left back? It's Winkler. How good is he? He's got potential to be special. Exciting prospect. There's another nice thing is we got some competition for like four spots right now. And I think we should play that first game against 1860 Munich. You know, so when I was looking to do this series, I was looking to do it with Munich, but then I saw that they have they have a financial requirement of one, and I I can barely I can manage two threes usually the highest I like to go, just because you never know what they're gonna throw your way. All right, bring it on Munich. So the starting lineup is as follows: Bats and goal. Subchenko, Muller, Gash, Winkler, backline, Seitz, Bosel, defensive mids, Schneider, Shipnowski on the wings, Janik attacking mid, and Gunter Schmidt at striker. I mean, 1860 Munich, they're a decent team. I mean, they're, they're nothing special, but... They're definitely one of the better teams in this division. I mean, considering that they're fourth and lucky. Although I wouldn't mind being, I wouldn't mind being all the way up in fourth. Do not realize. Okay, let's take a quick break here. Only 8.4% of you guys that watch my videos are actually subscribed. And I'm assuming that if you're still watching by this point, you are enjoying the content. So you should hit that subscribe button. Now let's get back into the video. Eh, it's actually not that much of a kick clash. Jeez, why is Lex pressing so much? The thing is, I've done a couple of uh, career modes with 1860 Munich, so I know a couple of their players. Like Lex is a pretty fast technical winger slash striker. The guy that's on the ball right now, Molders, is a big physical strong striker. But what a tackle for Sevchenko! Like that was that was beautiful. That was one, oh, one of a kind. Goal saving, I'd say. There we go, Shipnowski. Cut it back. Janik. Alright, if you're new to this series, and if you are a fan of Sarbrucken, I would like to apologize now. I don't know how you feel about Janik and Gunter Schmidt, but I hate both of them. But, I don't have any replacements, so they are the players I'm stuck using. Good goal, I mean, good goal by Janik. I could have scored that, but you know. I just hate them, they're they don't, they don't fit what I want from a striker or an attacking mid. Which is why I hate them. 
and I did not realize how much of an issue that would be until like too late in the season. It's okay. At least it's nice to know heading into next season what I want to fix. And we're in the month of March, I think. So it's 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 kind of nice to. You know, if I feel a little bit less nervous about next season, just because I mean I know what I want. I already have a plan for next season. Well, I don't really, but I know what I need to plan for. Schneider, dude. Oh, okay. Never mind. I was gonna say I thought he just straight up missed that. So if you don't know, if you haven't seen any previous episodes, which I'm guessing most of you haven't, so Schneider, our starting left mid, is actually a center back. I guess I know that sounds crazy, but he has he has potential to be special. But he's five foot nine. He's a lefty. He has incredible pace. Incredible physical stats like stamina, jumping, strength. But his technical stats, you know, passing, shooting, dribbling, defending, they're like all 55. Like they're they're pretty much all identical. So I was then I had to deliberate. Okay, well, where do I want him? But then the whole fact that he's five foot nine, I can't I can't put a five foot nine player at center back. It's like oh yeah, maybe I could put him at striker. You know, he's got. Good physicality, good speed, but then I'm like, I can't really have a five foot nine player striker either. And I'm like, okay, well he's not technical enough to play my attacking mid. Um, where else can I stick him? Oh, I can put him in at. I put him in at an outside mid, and I was like, oh, right, I'll just put him in left mid. And so far, I mean, he hasn't been bad, considering. He hasn't impressed me. He hasn't he hasn't disappointed me, but he also has not impressed me. Beautiful move by the team. Beautiful move. Look at that. Excellent pressing <laughs> to get the ball back. And then an excellent find from Chipnowski into Gunter Schmidt. Like, I don't have anything against Gunter Schmidt. It's just the combination of him with Janik. And Kutcher Schmidt is also slow. I don't, I don't like having a slow striker. I like to have a uh, quick, pacier striker. Because I like always have my strikers running behind. Because then that usually draws a man. and opens up my attacking mid to do some damage. Like, that's why I don't want Janik. There's no reason for him to mess that up that badly. Uh, ooh, that's actually not going to go out of bounds. So Chenko's going to chase it down. Offsides. Shipnowski is by far our best player. Because the other thing I was thinking is, you know, hey, with Schneider and Shipnowski, like Shipnowski is our right mid, and he's already, without a doubt, the best player on the team. If we could have our best players on the team be our wingers, that would just lessen the stress so much on the on that so center mid positions. Because right now I don't really have a plan for the future for these any of these center mid positions. Out of bounds. Because, I mean... Oh, whoa. That's not... I told you to pass it to... Gash, not... Out to... Winkler. Where are you going, Steinhardt? Where are you going? Exactly. Nowhere.
Alright, another thing I've realized. Ooh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You're kidding. After halftime, I'll pick up. I'll pick up back where I left off. It's so dumb. That's so annoying. Like literally a minute before half. We got a foul ref. Ah. Uh kidding <laughs> uh. so what I was gonna talk about was the fact that I don't know if you guys you know if you're subscribed to my channel or if you know anything about my channel but I've got I think seven six or seven like FIFA series that are concurrently going all going on at the same time together and I don't know See, the problem I kind of have with it is, like, the episode to episode, like, the flow. You know, so, like, like, last episode, I could have been talking about how, oh, yeah, I want to switch to a formation like this. But I have no clue if, I can't remember that because I recorded the last episode four days ago. Plus, I also have, you know, six other series, five, five or six other FIFA series I'm recording, plus all my Madden stuff that's different. So, I'm thinking, hopefully, when I get a PlayStation 5, again, hopefully, by June-ish, then I'll probably end up switching to, you know, a little bit more of, like, okay, two series, and it's likely going to be, oh, come on, Janik. And it's likely going to be a, uh... Road to Glory with an EFL League 2 team, because that's my, one of my favorite things to do on FIFA, but, like, a legitimate one where I don't just quit after the second season, like, half of them out on my channel. And a Premier League career mode series, which you guys actually will just... There's a video out on my channel. Actually, might be a little... You might have seen a little card for it at the beginning of this video. It's just because I want, you know, I make content for you guys. And... I really don't have a preference for my what team I'm going to do my Premier League crew mode with. So I have a little video just simply asking you guys, hey, what should I do? Now, if it doesn't get any views by, probably by the time this is, this has actually, you know, come out, then if you're subscribed, I'm sorry, but I'll be mass spamming that because I really want to know. What a ball in a Shipnowski. Oh, Janik. And don't worry, if I don't get a play PlayStation 5, they're st still, like, kind of at the time. I will switch to a more, you know, like, one series type thing. Because the other thing is, like, a FIFA 21, I'm going to be honest, I haven't actually completed any Road to Glories. Or like career modes, like I've never. Like this is pr considering the fact that this is what March of the first season. I'm still doing this. It's actually pretty impressive. Come on Zeitz. Oh. See, I also I do want to kind of switch that whole like. So I mean, you watch this, you watch this series, and there's a there's a very solid chance you're not seeing another episode until you know if this comes out like on a Monday, 
you're not seeing another episode till like a Thursday. You know, if you're a fan of this series and you want to subscribe, well, then you also have to get all of like the ten other series that I'm doing, just from FIFA. Then there's all my stuff from Madden and other games like that. So I kind of want to, you know, have like legitimate series. So I also, I also not really approaching these series this hard. Another thing is like. My very first FIFA, my very first series I even did on this channel. My Cambridge United Road to Glory. Whenever that was on my channel, I mean it was also totally different. I was posting maybe once every four days. But like Cah. That was, that was like, that was it on my channel, it's just, because I was planning on just being a FIFA Road to Glory career mode guy. I wasn't planning on branching out to Madden, Minecraft, Rocket League, Hill Climb Racing I did a little bit of. I even played some Bingo, Catan Universe. But then, you know, I was putting off the end of that series because, I mean, you know, You know, I was in the you know, YouTube game, I was like, oh yeah, my channel's going to blow up. I mean, yeah. So I wanted to hold off posting the end of the Cambridge United, like the last couple of episodes, until I had a little bit, you know, it's hoping like, oh yeah, I'll get like 10 subscribers in the first month. Well, I, I got 10 subscribers in my first 8 months. So I was thinking, you know, oh, I don't want to post this until... You know, I mean, I didn't even record the last, like, four episodes. I was like, oh, yeah, I'll just wait, you know, get a little bit more viewers and a little bit more subscribers, and then I'll post it. Well, then it's, okay, well, I also don't want to just stop posting for a month, or no, not a month, like, two weeks. I also got to put another series out, so then I started another EFL Road to Glory, even though I just finished one. And... Evidently, I didn't finish that Road to Glory either, because I just got bored and sick of it. Because, you know, I had literally had already done the same exact thing. So then it turned into, okay, well, I hate recording this series. I don't want to record this series, because I want to wait till I'm a little bit bigger. So then I started a German Road to Glory, which I was loving. But then I got so involved in that... By the time I was like, oh, I should, I need to, you know, I need to play and record this other, oh, that's a pen. You know, I need to play and record this other series. By that time, it was, oh, but, uh, yeah, I guess I should, you know, my German Road to Glory is kind of getting a little bit dead. You know, it's a little bored now. And then it just kept turning into, oh, well, you know, I don't really want to do this one right now. Okay, I'll just go ahead and I'll do this one. And there was no structure in my channel. And I've, to be honest, I've kind of let it go that way. You know, there isn't really a structure but that is all changing because I believe as long as I check my notes I think you're seeing this sometime in May and I'm assuming this, if you're seeing this on my main channel which I assume you probably are I've switched my kind of like upload schedule so I got it goes three FIFA videos three Madden videos and a Catan universe or FIFA video so I do have a structure and I'll make a whole video about that whenever the time comes. But yeah, I mean, I'm assuming that you guys would like, you know, a legit series on my channel. You know, so it's like, oh, and, you know, after five days, it's not, oh, he's got five new series out, or, oh, yay, preseason's over for all of them. It's, oh, hey, we're five days in and he's fighting for promotion. I also do kind of want to have, like, I want to I want to finish a Road to Glory on FIFA 21. I want to win the Champions League with the League 2 side in FIFA 21. I've not done so yet. I want to change that. Oh, yeah, and if you're new to this channel and you're still watching, uh, let me know in the comments if you like me, like, kind of, like, talking to you guys this much, or if you guys want me to focus more on the game. I actually focus more on the game just because... I mean, evidently that's what you're here to watch, but... 
I have considered kind of doing some videos where I just kind of like, you know, I just play some background footage in the video of just like a FIFA game or whatever. And I just sit there and I just talk into my phone and just kind of, you know, a little like mini podcast type thing. But yeah. I, I mean, I'm still, even though I'm more than a year in, this is still, it's still all new to me. <sighs> I'm not playing Kaiser, Kaiser Slaughter. Ich danke fürs Kommen. Wir können dann jetzt mit den Fragen beginnen. We're not going up, but we're definitely going to finish in a good spot. I mean, really, all, all you can ask for. Danke. Another thing I like doing with... Like... People, I do, I do really like enjoying. You know, I mean, everyone knows, in every road to glory, there is usually that one like youth player from like day one, where you just kind of grow them up. Like I still remember, I can tell you all about my first game to United Road to Glory it was Victor Gordson, left mid United States, finished as 94 overall. Like he was, he was, came our Cambridge United homegrown stud, and I don't think I'll remember him. I think I'll remember him for a very, very long time. All these other FIFA career mode series, I can't name you a single youth player. That's why another reason why I want to change those full, you know, full length things so that, again, I, I like to see where this team goes, you know. I want to have a legit, like a legit, legit road to glory. Okay, we're just gonna send that game. Cause I also I also love a nice promotion chase. But yeah, I mean I just I haven't really I was talking to my brother I think a couple of weeks ago. I haven't really like filled the void of that first FIFA series. Now, you know, obviously, there's reasons for it. You know, it's your first series. Obviously, you're gonna remember that. But it's also well, I went all the way to the Champions League final with that Cambridge United team. So it's also the point of well, I haven't been able to replicate that success because I haven't I haven't tried. And well, I'm really looking to change that. <sighs> For that, let's go to conclude this episode of the Sarbrucken Road to Glory. And it's it was a different episode than normal. Next episode probably won't be like this, but a little bit different episode. You guys, just comment down below anything. Just comment pretty much anything, and I'll... First off, you will get a reply, because... Well, I get maybe one comment a week, so you do not have to worry about that. But yeah, just comment anything down below. If, you, if you're if you still here, you obviously are like it or you're being held against your will. Either way, hit that subscribe button. Hope that you guys all have enjoyed, and it is Jay Biebs signing off.